हेलो एंड वेलकम टू सोल्यूशन कोड इन दिस वीडियो विल सी हाउ टू यूज सी के एडिटर इन पी एच पी इन दिस वीडियो सीरीज विल लर्न हाउ टू एम्बेड सी के एडिटर इन द पी एच पी पेज एज वेल एज हाउ टू स्टोर एंड रिट्राइव the information entered in the ck editor on the web pages so let's start first thing is we have to download the ck editor so just go on google and google ck editor download and this is a link ckeditor.com slash downloads where you have to go and this page it looks like this and here you have options to select a package so I have selected full package if you want you can select a standard package and click on download so once you click on download you can see that I have already downloaded a zip then a zip would be downloaded once the zip is downloaded now we have to make a PHP page so first of all let's let's start XAMPP I'm using XAMPP and let's make a folder for our project inside C drive my XAMPP HD docs and here I am creating a folder named CK editor CK editor example EX so you have to go inside that and I'm giving this as a name index dot PHP and this is being created now first we'll light the basic HTML head title if you want to body let's give it some title let's give it some title like oops I missed it CK editor okay now so once everything is set up now we can do one thing we have already downloaded CK editor just copy the CK editor zip and go inside your XAMPP HD docs and your working directory which is CK editor example paste it here extract this thing here and delete the zip now inside the CK editor we have to just we have to link the CK editor.js in our file and that's it and just we have to call so we just want to uh, uh, write script and set the source of this to CK editor CK editor oh, I spelled it wrong CK editor CK editor dot JS and so we have linked the script in this page so we can use CK editor in this page so let's make a text area and give it a class it's very important 
So you give it a class as CK editor and just the name as editor and you won't believe me that's it now when you refresh localhost slash rick editor ex you it's done now this is your ck editor now you can just test it here you if you want bold italics if you want greater size you can just select that also with it fonts if you want to change the font si font family of it you can do that too if you want it to look like a heading you can do that if you want to change the styles of it you can do that if you want to insert images tables etc you can do everything whatever you want using the ck editor so this is how you embed ck editor in the web pages hope you like this video in the next video we'll see how to uh, store the information or the text entered text or images whatever entered here in the database and retrieve it on any page where, where you want to thank you for watching guys hope you like subscribe and comment below if you have any doubt see you